Hi, you want to build your landing page fast, easy and without an extra effort? Definitely this video can be handy for you because in this video you'll find out how to build it by yourself without an extra knowledge like coding or web design and how to make it really fast uh, and how to make it easy and in professional way. Because today in this video I want to show you the platform that will help you to uh, build your own landing page or website really fast, really easy uh, in most convenient way that you even could imagine. So uh, this platform is absolutely fantastic because it gives you the possibility to uh, not only to build a page but to promote it, to integrate external tools to it and, and a lot of interesting things and that's what I want to show you in this video. I don't want to make this video like one hour long tutorial because uh, I saw those videos in internet and I don't like to uh, make the same. I don't want to waste your time. So let's jump straight to business. First that you need to know that our team left the link in the description panel of this video and we uh, left it specially for you so you can uh, easily get access to this platform straight from this video. Uh, and this is most convenient way. So then you need to press start a free trial and you'll have 14 days to build everything up. But believe me, one hour is pretty enough. Uh, so I want to make this video as short as possible with a maximum value for you. So let's jump in. That is the dashboard of this platform. So landing pages, sites, conversion tools, leads, brands, images, lead magnets, integrations, domains and support. And we're not going to talk about all that. We're going to create a new landing page because we're talking about the landing pages. And you see there are a lot of interesting and efficient and professional looking templates that can suit to any type of business. And if you have specific uh, idea, you can sort these templates by page type, like blank, could it be a free resource and download and so on and so on. Or you can sort it by industry or even by style and color. Uh, so maybe you working in health and wellness and you want to build it up so it's much better and faster to find the correct template and it will save you a lot of time of editing uh, but doesn't matter because uh, actually it matters yeah uh, if you want to save some time but it doesn't matter uh, which mm, which one template you'll get because uh, all the editing features are pretty the same and that's what i want to show you um let's building uh i know that there's yeah let's start building this one this is the simple layout and uh, it's coming soon so let's build it up first you need to give a page a name that can be changed later uh and here where can you make that happen like you can type it in because this is gonna be in url also yeah uh we have simple one page uh coming soon yeah so let's start from the beginning what do we have here we have this lead matter excellent tool that uh, shows you how your page will convert your visitors to customers layout sections widgets styles and settings uh, preview redo undo save and publish uh the final button that you will press on this uh, on this tool Let's go to layout. We see that we have hero and footer sections. There's only two of them, hero and footer. You can see them here. If you need some extra, you can add some like about or contact us or uh, one from the list, like hero, logos, plans, testimonials. Or if you didn't found, you can use a uh, blank template, uh, blank template of a section. Yeah, blank section. You can drag and drop it uh you can go back to layout and you see hero footer blank and about about we don't need this about uh here so we're gonna delete this stuff we can delete it from here or we can delete it from this spot also uh, blank and footer you see the blank is under the footer uh, and we you see this hand just grabbing it and moving it to the basement that's it we have a layout and we have a color here where is that color lace it's blank uh, template so it should be transparent uh that's why we're gonna go to styles to check yeah there's a page background you see if we're switching it off here you go you have uh 
total transparency. So our new side is coming. So let's hover over the surface. And you see that each element has this pencil button, except the uh, spacers. See, you see, you see each element has this pencil button. All the editing things you can make happening with this pencil. So you have some text, you have some lines, and you have the blank uh, section. Let's go to edit this black section uh, first, or maybe let's change the background of this uh, this section. We need to go to edit section settings, and here you go, you see the uh, image. You see that there's an image color overlay, and I'm gonna show you that this is very, very convenient tool, really. So we're gonna change an image here. You can use the pictures that you uploaded previously, uh, to maybe one of to one of your projects, uh, or you can use uh, no, it's not good quality picture. I remembered, uh, or you can use the pictures from your laptop or computer, or of course you can uh, buy some pictures from Shutterstock straight here on the on the platform. You see, the picture is great by itself, but uh, the text is pretty invisible right now. So we need to uh, apply image color overlay. Let's go and add some color. You see the black one. Bam, and everything is black uh, or red or any color that you want or green. Yeah, uh, just to show you, uh, I'm going to use the black color or maybe the gray one. We have this gray color and we change in the opacity. And you see the picture is still there. It, it's uh, it can be seen that uh, is there. Yeah. And all the text is in the contrast. And everything is pretty readable and that's great tool uh, to make such things. All right, let's go to next uh, big thing is widgets show less. And those eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, those eight is pretty enough to build everything up, everything literally that you want. Uh, if we're gonna press show more, there are a lot of interesting things like icons, progress bar, social like, social share, calendar ambit, uh, and countdown and HTML. So those uh, are for pros, and if you're building something simple, uh, it's enough to use these tools. Like video, drag and drop um, button drag and you see you can drop this button to the spots where you can uh, see the drop here boxes yeah it actually doesn't matter that we have uh, this two blocks especially for widgets you can drop this widgets here okay or you can move it here and we have this column and we have nothing here. So let's add an image here. And you see also you can drop it uh, like whatever you want. But we have two columns here. Why not? Alrighty. Uh, then you see that button is uh, like big and you see the divider because we have two columns here. You can move this divider to reshape the objects automatically. Cool. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, for example, you need this button to be in the center of this field. Just grab a spacer and drop it in here above the button. Just resizing the spacer. That's pretty it. Uh, let's change the color of a background of this section. And we used to have this gray color here on the top. And it looks pretty, pretty great and pretty balanced. And I like it. So here you go. We have a ready website. Just need to um, switch on the video ambit code here in the video and pictures and an image. Let's add an, let's add some image. Like just to show you the same, the same image that we have there. We can apply here and we have all those all those stuff to change set max image can be left hand right hand rounded you see or even circular 
can be like that. Like everything that you actually want can be done uh, and, and just sign up. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome. I like this tool because you really can build everything up and you can customize everything. Uh, but let's jump to buttons and forms because, uh, okay, one more thing. Page size. Uh, minimum eight, you see. So this section is pretty, uh, pretty automatically shaped. But if we need this to be okay, it's not changing so mu uh, much. Like, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna delete this to show you the difference. You see, the picture is resizing. Not the picture, the block, the, the, the section. Okay, so where's the button? Let's go to widgets and button here. It's a big button to drop here. All right. You see, you need to add the click event. All the things with the button can be changed here. Medium, large, full width, small one. Uh, okay. Add, you need to add the click event. What's going to happen when somebody will physically press that button on your side? No link option, open a pop up, open Calendly pop up, jump to a page section, link to landing page or external URL. In most cases, it's going to be the pop up. You can create new or select the pop up from the um, uh, that pop up that uh, template has, and you can edit this pop up. Uh, all the colors, all the fonts can be changed here in edit section settings. I'll, uh, I, I showed it to you previously on uh, those previous sections. So you need to edit integration. This is one of the most important part, actually. Uh, how are you going to get lead notifications to your inbox of your email? Or you can switch on, you can integrate external service of email marketing. And there's impressive list, active campaign, convert kit, get response, MailChimp, constant contact. A lot of them uh, has free uh, options um, to not so big audience, so you can use uh, those tools, or you can use Zapier with the Google Sheets, and you're gonna get uh, to a new sheet. You're gonna get notifications to new list in your Google Sheets, uh, and that's pretty it. If you don't have a lot of um, a lot of leads per day, it's pretty enough to get straight to your email, but it's most uh, more. Uh, useful to get some uh, CRM system but is the issue for another video fields uh, email let's add some field first name do not add more than two fields because people are lazy and they don't want to fulfill all those stuff they don't want to type a lot you know, so first name and email is pretty enough uh, and actions what's gonna be like want to stay in the loop uh, subscribe and we'll let you know when our site our launches or maybe uh, check our PDF with a checklist, like download our PDF with a checklist, just send us an e email and we're going to send it to you. You can add this lead magnet, you can add this file here, or it can be landing page, external URL or remain in page or default lead pages, thank you page. It's up to you which option to choose, uh, but I showed you the main things that you need to know. Uh, Let's go to settings and a couple words about that. SEO, definitely one of the most important parts of any landing site or a web page or landing page uh, to be visible to search engines. If not, you need to switch this flag. Uh, so type in your title, type in descriptions and keywords and so on. Social, if you want to share your link to your landing page to some Facebook, maybe your own account, uh, it can be done, but you need to take care about this picture that be uploaded analytics, Google analytical tracking ID and all the tracking codes uh, can be done here. Language, you can switch the language to one of those. That's it, guys, I showed you everything. I showed you uh, layout, sections, widgets, styles and settings and now you know how to build it by yourself. Now you know that everything with the text happening with this uh, with this button and uh, now you know that you can make everything that you want in a simple way really fast and by your own hands without hiring some professionals uh, for big big money that's it if you need to start right now find the link in the description panel 
uh, down there and use that link. Go to the platform, pass the registration, start building your own landing page right away. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you consider this video as useful and uh, you'll press that like button. Thank you. See you. Cheers. Bye-bye.